All right, so we have uh, fought the dominant of wind, who is Benedicta, and she sucks. And she has her and her people have. Oh, my darling. I can't bear another night without you. Oh, who are they talking about? And uh, the dominant of fire is imprisoned by them. And the road here cuts through Lord we're gonna try and kill the dominant of fire. You're not thinking of heading that way, are you? All right, something bad must have happened where we're going. Um, we want to kill the dominant fire. To take the care that are posted centuries to prevent any unwelcome surprises. At least I would have. Well, you should know. Because the dominant fire killed our brother Joshua, and uh, the dominant fire was with some lady, who they appear to be really close. I imagine a shield of sorts, kind of like how we were to Joshua, but I could be wrong. Um, and um, we're gonna try and kill him, but I have a feeling that he's not bad and was just being used. Keep your distance, boy. There, boy. All right, um, yeah, I just have a feeling that the dominant of fire might be a victim, just like all most of the dominants seem to be. You know, they're used because they're powerful. What is thinking? Why take a stronghold they've no chance of holding? When they've no intention of holding it. The king is up to something. The king? Well, you don't think they're acting on a whim, do you? This is one of his majesty's cunning stunts. And he sent his best to execute it. Alright, first I see shiny stuff here. <laughs> Sorry guys, this is how I play games. I always get the extra shit. Ah, look at that. <laughs> I'll tell your lady you tried. <laughs> That's bad funny. Sid is the man. Care moment. Hard not to crack even when it isn't crawling with royalists. I don't care who else is in there. You can you will. You will. That time of fire is gonna become our friend, you'll see. The one we should be after is our stupid mom. What? What's happening? Much as I enjoy battering down the front door, I hazard this endeavor will require a bit more tact. There's an old sluice that empties under the bridge. 
it should see us through to the lower levels of the care. Sid. We both know why I'm here. But what is it that you want? Why would you risk your life for a handful of outcasts? If anyone ever learned what you've been doing with their property... They got my head in a box. But this isn't just about dominance and bearers, it's about all of us. What I want is to build a place where it doesn't matter what you are, but who you are. Mm. And our world isn't ready for a place like that. That's right. So, until it is, I use the power I've been given to show people there is hope. You gotta love Sid, man. He's a man of the people. Seem to have a relationship and prior worst to decision I ever made. Mm -hmm. Don't underestimate her, Clive. A fight with her icon is not one you're likely to walk away from. Garuda, Warden of the Wind. to into Kirnervent. Central Sambrique once used as a stronghold, the Holy Empire has since disgarrisoned the strategic position along the ne neutral crystal belt and now employs in the training of Imperial Army recruits. Her nail polish is the color of baby throb. The land has fallen. The eastern territories all but belong to the orcs. I'll have my men ready to depart by noon. Don't bother. But what of the mines? Without adamantite... The light would have engulfed the mines ere long. Besides, you are. She seems with a lot of different orders. people, huh? Dark swallows more of the realm with each passing day. The land starved of the ether that gives it life. And as the fringes fade, the people flock to the mother crystals, desperate for their blessing. The war we wage for possession of that blessing, it breaks us from within, hastening us to our own destruction. So you do what must be done. I unite the dominance, hmm. that we may bring an end to the strife, and found a new order to see us unto tomorrow. The world must be restored, and I will see it so. You might have already had Sidolphus not betrayed us. Him again. Lust you still for his embrace? Mm, they were a thing. But... Of course not. I serve you and you alone. Mm, no, that's not true. I saw you with the other guy. I remember well the day you first entered these halls. Your pale hand pressed into his as if it would never let go. That. that was a long time ago. Yours is the only hand I need. Always. 
soon, my dear. Soon all will know whose hand it is that keeps them from falling into the darkness. Hold me, my leash. Never let me go. <laughs> Benedicta be getting around. <laughs> I wonder if she's she's using like one of our sentries has failed to report. She really loves Sid, but orders, she's using them her. Back inside the care, girls. He is here, then. Have them lead Sid and his little pet to the chapel. I shall entertain them there. Her sexuality for some kind of power, which wouldn't be uncommon. So you've come for me after all. She does still like him. All clear. Time. Yeah, that's what Joshua did. I thought it was really cool too. We should start with the dungeons. They may be holding the bearers there. Sound plan. As long as we keep ourselves on this side of the bars. In here. They're all empty. And you're gonna give up. Sid. This gate. Need some help. <clears throat> what do you think? That I'm doing most of the lifting. <laughs> I really like the lighting in this game. Did you hear that? Unfortunately, yes. Hello. Oh no, I didn't mean to use that. Fuck, I hate, it. I hate when it does that. Um, I don't know. I'm just going straight. This door only leads to more royalists. We better find another one. Take a break. Take a break, he said? Damn, look at that fireplace. Looks so cozy. It's not that far. Bloody show off. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Alright, so there's this way and there's up. Huh. Let well, me see this way. We found the Imperial garrison. Right where the Royalists left. Damn, there's so many different ways to go. 
Damn, we could go up too? This is too much. Let's see over here first. Alright, cool. Damn it. Hold on. They're everywhere. I'm gonna go the wrong way. <laughs> no matter what. All right, this let's just take care of these guys. Get them all you've got, boys. Damn, I feel like this is the way we're supposed to go. I'm so I'm so crazy, guys, that I just can't I have to do everything, you know? I feel like this keeps keeps going up, so I wanna go the other path. There were like three different paths. Well two now. <sighs> Does anyone else do this shit? Hopefully this doesn't go too far anywhere. Um, okay, that's where we came from. So let's go this way. I honestly don't know. Whoa. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
All right, so that was like a little mini, not a mini boss, but oh my god, why there's so many different places to go? Holy shit! All right, um, I guess we'll go through the little door first. Circle us back around. It sure does. I think that's exactly what happened. Yeah. Okay, that's good. I think. Is this shit connected like that? Alright, let's go the other door through that other door. Not this one. This one. What happened to our little fire flashlight? Okay, so this looped us back around. Cool. I'm pretty sure we did everything at this point. I hope. <laughs> so how do we proceed? Okay, this keeps bringing me in a circle. I guess we'll go back this way? This swooped us back around too, though. Unless there was something I missed. There we go. Never were one for half measures, were you, Benedicta? These poor sods didn't know what hit them. You know what? I heard, actually, I almost forgot. Somebody told me that these are actually cheap items. Cheap items? Um, these. I didn't... I didn't realize that. I thought they were just things that you can equip. So I think I'm going to equip like, yeah, that's fine. Healing potion potency, just like natural stuff, like normal stuff. Favor of fire, cyclone. 
That's 8% Scarlet Cyclone damage, I guess. And then increased attack by 7. Pet commands are executed automatically. That's kind of cool. Defense by 10. I think this is good. Let's just see how this goes with... You know what I mean? Um, can I? I guess I could sell that. Yeah, let's see if this feels any better. Like, not better, but like a little more challenging. Because I hear, I, I was looking at the trophy get, guy, and they said that those were cheap, cheat, not cheap weapons, but they were like, yeah, kind of cheap weapons. I didn't, I mean, items. I didn't realize that. I thought they were just items that they gave you for like pre-ordering the game or something. Attacking an opponent from the front while it's guarding will deal no damage. Circle the rear to penetrate its defenses. Certain basic skills such as burning blade and charred magic as well as iconic abilities such as Phoenix Rising Flames can instantly break an opponent's guard even when delivered from the front. Okay. We have them. Seems they were expecting us. You don't say. I keep using my fucking items because they keep switching it on me. I hate that it's the same buttons. Right, right, right. How about this? New enemies already? much harder without them. I feel like I was still playing as if I... I don't know. My wounds, boy. It's a little help. Togo. Well done, Togo. It's not that much harder without the items, to be honest. But we'll see when we fight a boss. Maybe it'll be different. Because I know that lizard boss we fought rolled a lot, so... Yeah. See, it keeps switching back. I freaking hate that shit. It's so easy. Alright. I wish it was to hold it down. You know what I mean? Instead of tap it. But whatever. Maybe I'll get used to it. I just hate that I wasted all my, like, tonic without wanting to on bullshit enemies. Because I didn't realize that it was switched to, like, the potions and shit. He's like, nah, leave wifey alone. 
A little late for prayer, isn't it? Do I seem so desperate as to grovel at the feet of a false god? <laughs> I was waiting for you. Not for too long, I hope. All this for a midnight chat. Well, let's chat then. Where are the men and women you took from Lost Wing? You mean, where's the Dominant? Well, we shall be requiring his services indefinitely. Come back to me, Sidolphus. I need you. Think of all the things we can create together. The world that we can build. She's just doing it for power. You me. <laughs> Your king needs me. Exactly. I'm all for building a new world. Just not his. That bastard's dreams are as twisted as his promises are false. And I want no part of it. King Barnabas saved you, and this is how you speak of him. Have you no shred of loyalty? What? To a leader who'd use me? Like he uses you. Yeah. You know nothing of me, Sidolphus. You're right. I don't know who you are anymore. Or what you want. I only know what you used to say. That you were tired of running. That you just wanted to be free. Free of it all. You weren't lying to me then, so what changed? What made you think you had to sacrifice who you were to get what you wanted? Mm. Sacrifice? I use my talents to my advantage and you would tell me there is shame in that? If there's no shame, then why do you feel so sorry for yourself? A rousing speech, Lord Commander. I was a fool to believe you might have changed. The only person I feel sorry for is you! She mad mad. I can't do this anymore. I think she might be losing control. If you would stand between our leash and his dream, then you leave me no choice. Goodbye, Sidolphus. They really loved each other. She's about to go Super Saiyan. Oh, shoot. Stand back, Clive. So there's like some kind of way that you could like fuse. Like, he did it too, right? Fusing the power so that you're not fully transformed. Yeah. Oh my god, this is so cool. This is a fucking Dragon Ball fight. Final Dragon Ball fantasy. Oh my god. Herself or something? Oh, get away.
All right, they're both staggered. Let's go. I'm gonna focus fire on one. It's telling me that one's the boss, though. It's okay. Oh, come on! I'm, I meant to dodge away from it. Jeez. Okay, I'm gonna use a potion. Oh my god, okay, wow. Oh no! Oh shit. I am trying to dodge. Alright, one down. She doesn't look happy, Togo. Come on. No! Oh my god! She did a checkerboard. these combos press square just as an opponent attacks a parry the strike temporarily slowing down time what Let's try and parry. Fucking me up. <laughs> A little help. Not this time. There we go. I tried pairing all three of those. Oh no. Keep your distance, boy. Get fucked. Alright, it is a little more challenging without those items. I lied. It's still good though. I, I I think I like it better without the items. Makes me think a little bit more rather than just like <laughs> butt mashing. <laughs> that was cool. That was a freaking Dragon Ball fight between Sid and Benedicta. Their dominance. Or their fuse dominance, it's like right? fusion kind of thing. Do I look all right? 
Benedicta will be on her way to collect the Dominant, if she hasn't already. You can't afford to let them leave. Remember, she has wings, you don't. What about you? Before or after I catch my breath. Sorry. Come on, Toggle. Let's go Mimi's. She must be here somewhere. Oh man. Ooh, let's see that. The Favor of Fire, Scarlet Cyclone, or Heat Wave. So this one, it's just one percent more. Oh, I picked up a high potion, but I couldn't use it. Alright. I guess I gotta sell some stuff, no? The withdrawal has been signaled. Some opponents will cast cure spells to heal their enemies to feed the spellcasters first. Cool. Let's go. Give them all you've got, boys. Oh, it's over. Oh. get there. No, I'm gonna go here. <laughs> How? Maybe I have to come back down. I'm running out of tower. How lazy wants us gone before sunrise. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Nice. Very good. Spellcaster here? There we go. He's done. I can't 
kill them. Is there another one? Oh, here we go. I love that collateral cyclone. Continue. Yeah, this is going up, so hold on. There was something. Hold on, wait, wait. Yeah, hold on, wait. There was something over here. Was it around this way? Yes, it was. Nice doggy. Move, move. Nice. Let's try and parry this guy. How about that? God, why? <sighs> I'm so sick of this mechanic already. Was a little tough. Oh man, so many doors. Mm, this looks like where we go. Let's see this one first. Okay, perfect. Uh, maybe not perfect. I don't know. Cool. I'm glad that they use it, even though you can't pick it up. No, maybe this is where I'm so. I'm so confused. I'm trying to go the wrong way, guys, so I can fully explore. I'll go up a little bit more. No, this keeps going. Oh my gosh. Did this just loop me back around? 
no, this is the way I wanted to go. Okay, all right, we're fine. Oh my God. Okay, this is the room, right? I hope so. Wait a minute. I I feel like I'm missing something. I know that's the way that keeps going up the stairs. And then this door takes us back. So I guess we're good. Alright. Pretty. Finally. Uh oh. I confess I expected more from the old man. Less from you. This is the second time you've bested my sisters. Men of your talents are rare indeed. Why cost your lot with such undesirables? If it is the hearth you long for, you will find more than enough warmth under my wings. Oh God. You know exactly what I want. Hand over the dominant, and I'll leave you in peace. You would dare to make demands of me. Are we gonna fight her? Officially? Know your place, little lamb. Fool is the shepherd who heeds every bleat of the flock. And I will suffer yours no longer. <laughs> Must I spell it out for you, Branded? No one is listening. No one at all! <laughs> Come, little lamb. To the slaughter with you. Oh my god. Keep your distance, boy. Get fucked. Ooh, I should have parried it. The music. Oh God. Okay. Keep wanting to dodge that.
good boy. Don't hit him. No! Uh, no Targle. I hate her. Oh no. Oh my god, she's flying everywhere. What is she doing? Oh my god. Stop! Stop flying everywhere! <laughs> So annoying. Finally, we barely did any damage to her. <sighs> oh, shut up. What is she doing? Stay yes, she staggered again. trying to parry again there we go shit 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 Oh my god. 
What the f Oh. <laughs> Not again. Ah. Okay. Enough. I'm gonna die. Oh, thank goodness. I'm still gonna die though. I have no more healing. She has last boss energy. <gasps> Torgo's okay. <sighs> Good boy. I'm so happy. Shit, Torgal. I'm dead. Oh my god, I'm dead. <sighs> oh my god. Bitch. Sorry. Not here. It's your fault she killed me. Oh, that's not bad. They don't start you from so far. What is that?
I hate this move. Oh, she's done. She was pretty tough. I maybe without these necklaces. I I use almost all my potions. I mean I did use all of them until she killed me. They gave me back my potions. Which was nice. Yeah, you got fucked I, up, bitch. I, how? Cause you suck. How did you do it? How did you even survive? How? The answer is simple, Benedicta. He was fighting for something he believed in. Shut up! Why aren't you dead? We've played your games. Now tell me where he is. Who? What are you? <gasps> Is he absorbing her power? Ultra hand. Wait. Why? Does this mean we can wield wind as well? have a, a beast and a summon in us. Enough of this. <gasps> we took her powers away from her. Are we gonna collect all these freaking creatures like Pokemon? Like like Naruto collecting all the <laughs> Jinchuriki? is ready to collapse and I'd rather not be here when it does if your dominant started this fire and I'm betting he did it'll be long gone damn it all with great power comes great responsibility that 
I created a diversion as commanded, Your Grace. The villagers escaped in the confusion. As should we. Yes. Come the cavalry, itching to butcher the bastards who made them miss their morning gruel. Go on, if they catch us leaving a burning care, people might jump to conclusions. Right. Winds of change. The power of wind. Clive has claimed a portion of the icon Garuda's essence. Attuning with Garuda not only changes the elemental aspect of Clive's magic spells, but allows to several new iconic abilities such as Gouge, a deadly flurry of talents that can appear tear into opponent for multiple an opponent for multiple hits. Ability details can be found in the abilities tab in the main menu. Garuda's Garuda's iconic feat, Deadly Embrace, can draw be used to draw multi uh, smaller, lighter enemies toward Clive. The action can also topple larger enemies that become partially staggered with their will gauge when their will gauge reaches 50%. Toppling an enemy in this manner can deal significant damage. Sorry, guys, I don't know why I can't read today. Press L2 to cycle between currently attuned icons in real time, allowing for more varied assault. Cool. Cooldowns for icon abilities are displayed in the corresponding icon in the ability widget. Ability availability for all attuned icons can be confirmed via the colored dots to the widget's right. Benedicta said you'd taken her power. All right. You don't still have it, do you? I think I do. I can feel it. It's inside me. I guess. Uh, well, are you not keen to try it out? What could possibly go wrong? All right, let's try it on these guys. Wow, that's fast. What about this one. Ooh. All right, and how do I switch it? Nice. That's move. Wow. All right. Cool. Eh. Sick. All right. That's really cool. So I'm guessing we're going to collect all of the dominant powers and become the strongest strongest person ever maybe that's what the king wanted he wanted to collect all the powers for himself and was using benedicta who can use her sexuality to like remember she was like seducing the other guy that big guy um the iron he was like really big <laughs> i think it was a titan the titan dominant or something So that's really cool. I mean, he's not gonna absorb SIDS unless Sid dies. Oh no, I hope Sid doesn't die. Um, I guess let's, yeah, let's just fight these guys and then I might wanna do some reading. 
<laughs> oh, is it wavering? So cool. I wonder how many different uh, elements we're gonna get. See, who needs to be a dominant when you could just do it all? Hold on, my cat's meowing. All right, let's do a little bit of reading. All right. A man named Margrace, a mysterious man that they believe to be a dominant of fire, rarely seen without a heavy robe or his loyal attendant, the two journeying together far and wide across the realm to an unknown end. All right, they added stuff to Sid. So um, he was soon to abandon his post and Benedicta that he might instead create a world where bear. Okay, we knew about this already. I don't know why. Benedicta. Commander of the Kingdom of Beloit's elite intelligencers and dominant of Garuda, the Warden of Wind. While her alliances with Hugo Kupka would appear to be naught but a ruse guided by the hand of King Barnabas, her love for her former Lord Commander, Sid, was deep and true and left an equally abyssal hole in her heart when he fled Waloid. Hmm. I'm kind of ready to, like, read all the other lore that we missed. <laughs> oh, it's only me! Dummy gun, are you trying to get yourself killed? It's not me who's been playing with fire! <sighs> Don't do things by half, steer. This way. If it wasn't you or him who freed the bearers, who was it? Good question. Someone who didn't have their hands full fighting a bloody harp here, I guess. But what matters is they're safe. Something they wouldn't be had it not been for you, Gav. Ah, just doing my job, like. So, uh, what about his dominant? Gone. And after we were so close. Can track him. Why would you? Sid told us about your family. Lost me on to Imperial Steel. Sometimes vengeance is the only thing that keeps you going. Thank you. Look safely, brothers. <laughs> I reckon he likes you. <laughs> he has a heart. Gav. She's gone. She's gone. My lady, you have to hold on. 
Gong si Gong, gong, gong. What am I going to do? Papa Barnabas? How long to the coastal road? At this pace, we won't make it by sunset. They're, he's probably gonna treat her like he'll, shit. He'll cast me up like all the others. Aww. What am I going to do? What am I going to do? Lady. Run away. <gasps> Oh no. Carol. Who is that? What do we have here? <laughs> Fetch a good price, I reckon. Who would we be doing the slavers of this service if we didn't? Praise her word. Wow, she can't even wield the sword without her power. I feel bad for her now. It's terrible. Oh, we're gonna get to know her backstory. Oh, it's all right. he saved her. They can't hurt you anymore. Let's go home. Is this it, Sadolphus? My punishment for not listening to you? Okay, Reaper. So cool. I'm confused though. She lost her power. But has it again? Did. Do you feel it too? The Ruta. By the flames. Oh my god. Vortex will swallow this whole forest and us along with it. And I'll stop her. You'll stop her. Someone is calling me. Damn it, lad. That doesn't mean you have to listen. Oh, I should have gone with you. <laughs> Whoa, that's so cool. Clyde, I don't think you understand. That's not just windy weather you're wandering into. Benedictus' rage knows no bounds. And that's on a good day. I don't want to know what's waiting inside that. Mm. But I do. I have to find out. And I'm not turning back. All right. Yeah, let's uh, 
I don't think wind attacks will do anything. I don't really have many healing items. Do we, like, fight all of them? I don't know, man. boy. Uh, I wish I could buy some potions before fighting her again. I just like move past these guys. There we go. Fuck it. I suppose we could, like, go back and, like, buy shit, upgrade or whatever, right? At the hideaway? Let's see. I think that might be wise right now, considering how much potion we use against Benedicta. Um... Let's see. Look what the curl dragged in. Going purse weighing you down. I'm gonna sell some shit. Yeah, I don't need this. You got how else? I reckon I can find a buyer. Mm. You got how else? Oh, she has a better sword. Hmm. Should I just buy it? Hmm. Yeah. You're rubbing me blind, you know. What? You got out else? Is that all? Make it quick. Sorry, what it be? I guess this is craft and this is reinforced, so I mean uh, Should I just craft the bastard sword? Or just reinforce the bastard sword? You know what I mean? Mm. 
Uh, sure. Yeah, that should do you. Mm. Yeah, why not? Not the best work, but it'll do. Alright. That'll do. Okay, let's see. What else do we have here? Upgrade our belt? Wait, what else? belt do we have? Hold on. What do we have equipped? Uh, iron belt? That's all we have. Garuda, oh. Damn. Hmm. Let's upgrade this. Ay ay ay. Can I? Should I reset everything? I don't know. It's fine. Um, I'm a little confused. I'm about to make you more busy. Okay, so Iron Belt 2, you're right. Why would they let. Oh, I guess if I had one. Um, yeah, I, whatever. You're gonna thank me later. I'm probably gonna get better shit anyway. I don't have any steel crowns, right? Or any of this shit. Alright. This would be if I wanted it. I only have one dragon's tail. Uh, I think I'm fine for now. Let's see what else. Forgot to ask about Karen, right? Yes. What? Second in interest, are you? She's got special ranges with the rabble browser. That's why I scratched his back and he scratches mine. Uh, use me old trading connections to bring in whatever him and his little band need and then pay what I ask. Sweeten the deal. He's given me a home here, far from prying eyes who'd wish me ill, and there's no shortage of them if you believe me. Alright. Suppose I'll see you around. Um, That's you next. Yeah, let's so go. Now we rest and regroup. Wait. Oh, this is something new? Like because we got new abilities, they want us to practice it if we want. Stage replay. No thanks. Alright. Do you think we should go and help? It sounds like <laughs> Alright, you have new yeah, shit. So many uses. Good day. Or <laughs> so cute. Clive tells Hippocrates is... Oh, he updated his tome. Okay. <laughs> there is a rather fascinating excerpt I've been meaning to show you. All right, new entries. Let's see. The Valestinian calendar, the dating system used throughout the twins, which marks the years of the realm that have passed since the signing of the Continental Accord some 800 years ago. In the century since, nations have rise, risen and fallen, and the concord between them has faltered, but the calendar persists. The Battle of the Tomb Realms, in case you forgot, it was a conflict fought between the Holy Empire of Sambrique and the Kingdom of Laloid in the year 865. Sambrique's forces... It's Sambricoi. Whatever. With the power of the Icon Bahamut on their side, took the Strait of Atha back to Valoid, putting an end to the blockade that had lasted several decades. The Valoiders looking to hold back the Sambricoi's advance by any means necessary form the alliance with the Jamaican Empire Republic who themselves were waging war against the Iron Kingdom and on the Western Front and prevented the Empire from progressing further. The Kingdom of Lloyd, a sole surviving nation of Ash, while Lloyd ha has its capital at Stonehear, home of the Mother Crystal of Drake's Spine, a warlike land, its considerable military might serve to keep neighboring countries at bay. Not all are deterred, however, the constant need to fight off hordes of beastmen prevents the royalists from launching a full incursion into the storm. Alright. So much. Aegis. Dating back to antiquity, the term Aegi has historically been used to describe those ethereal entities that can be conjured by dominance. Aegis are capable of casting potent magics corresponding to the element alignment of their creators, though 
unquestionably formidable, they will fade immediately should the dominant who gave them being happen to be slain. Ah, I see. So that's why she was able to summon multiple of them. Sharada, an ethereal conjuration summoned forth by Benedicta Harmon. When Clive encountered the dominant of wind near Lost Wing, despite their size, the creature's heavily feathered wings did not seem to hamper its movement, which was disconcertingly nimble. More so than speed, though, it was Sharada's array of powerful magics that set it apart from lesser foes. What about Garuda? Garuda, the Warden of Wind, who Benedicta transformed into during her ill-fated flight, the Empire takes form of a fearful harpy, summoning storms and tearing into the flesh of its prey like hawk-like talons. Such is an icon's frenzy for destruction that even the allies of the dominant, dominant of this day are wont to begin... Wait, sorry. The icon's frenzy for destruction that even allies of the dominant of the, of the day are wont to begin fleeing the battlefield when dark clouds gather overhead. That was weird writing, I think. Okay. The Eye of the Tempest, a raging vortex born upon Benedicta Harmon's descent into madness and loss of control over her icon, Garuda. Its power is such that not only are entire villages swept up by its passing, but the very ground beneath it. Shook. Save that, because I was just telling, um, yeah. Okay, Sharpna, the ethereal creation of Benedicta Harmon, dominant of wind. Was summoned on Kira Norva alongside her twin Shirada. The pair worked in tandem attempt to overwhelm Sid, um, wielding a panoply of potent magics and deadly aerial assaults. Okay. What subject shall we consider today? Oh my gosh. The Royal Intelligencers, the elite unit of Royal Knights of Valoid, led by Benedicta Harmon, who led clandestine incursions deep into the territory of enemy nations, unlike Valoid's main battlefield forces, whose orders are usually issued by their Lord Commander, the Intelligencers reported directly to the King, or at least they, at least they did until their disillusion in the aftermath of Sid and Clive's surprise attack to Kier Norvin. Geralt, second in command of Beloit's royal intelligence, is serving under Benedicta. Killed by Fopaz while attempting to evacuate the stricken Benedicta from the collapse in Kier Norvin. semi-priming the act of a dominant calling upon a part of their icon's power without fully transforming in okay that's what i was wondering about without transforming into the legendary beast itself it does not require nearly as much aether as a fully prime taking less of a toll on the dominant's flesh upon semi-priming the host takes on some aspect of the icon sprouting wings and becoming clad in stone that's really cool Karen, one of Sid's most trusted allies, a merchant who calls to hide away her home with a little help from her hardworking yet long-suffering apprentice Goitz. She can source whatever supplies the residents of the hideaway need, providing they are willing to pay. She wears a spy class in her right socket. Goats. I can't. I'm probably saying that wrong. Apprentice of Karen, an ally of the hideaway, a gentle giant who has a warm word for everyone but is not afraid to put his foot down in the face of injustice. Goats, um... Every waking moment is spent in service of his nun, and he can do little of his own accord without his uh, her express permission. That's cute. Oh. Gav, Sid's faithful scout who puts his legend legendary nose to work in tracking the movement of slavers, soldiers, and other objects of interest to the hideaway, the ever agreeable fellow, only too gladly delving behind enemy lines if he can get a good story or two out of it. Quentin, indestructible landlord of Lost Wings Tavern and the leader of the village. Huh. Attendant of Margrave, servant of a man who goes by the name of Lord Margrave. Together they travel across the twins to some unknown end. Alright. 
Mrs. Hideaway. We read about this, didn't we? A hidden refuge built on the fallen ruins of the blighted lands of Central Storm. Sid operates his secretive society of freed bears. They're called branded and ill-treated at their master's hands at their first experience of something of freedom, which the hideaway walls, it is even something as small as a hot meal or a soft bag could come into considerable shock. The Hanged Man, Quentin's Tavern in Lost Wing, it very much the beating heart of the village. Not only do the villagers congregate here to eat, drink, and marry, but it is also frequented by traveling traders seeking to load their wagons, the Lost Wing's famous wine. Oroville Downs, the southwestern Sambrique, where the Great Wood ends, lie the secluded meadows of Oroville. Here the soil is rich and the climate temperature while the sloped terrain provides ample runoff for rain, making the location perfect for growing wine grapes, something the residents of nearby Lost Wing take very seriously. Northern Valley, an expansive river valley that cuts through southern and central Sambrique. The fortress of Cairn Norbit rises along its eastern edge. Fallon, a mining settlement in the southern part of the continent of Ash. It is known for adam adamantite. And Amanium <laughs> produces highly prized for its unrivaled durability, but this is both a blessing and a curse, leading as it has repeated attacks up by marauding orcs over the years, though previously well protected, the encroachment of the blight has seen citizens deserting in their droves, leaving the town ever more vulnerable to attack. Bandits, those who make their coin by stealing from others and from their corpses, banditry is outlawed in every corner of the realm. So those who turn to it must make their beds far from the eyes of constabulary, often setting up camp in abandoned vigil villages. Some brigands will elect a band into small armies that together they might have the strength to make raids upon towns and villages in search of food and funds they need to survive. Okay, almost done. Icon. Magical beings of godlike strength who dwell within the human host knows as Dominus. I keep forgetting that name. I call them summons. Eight icons. So thus far we met um, Joshua, Icon of Fire, uh, uh, the Icon of Wind, which is Benedicta or was Benedicta, Icon of Lightning, which is Sid. Icon of Fire, Second Fire, which is more, more uh, something, whatever, the hooded person. Okay, so Fire, Water, Thunder, Ice. Well, we, we haven't met Ice. We haven't met Water. We haven't met Earth, Light, or Darkness. Come a belief is that two icons of the same animal cannot coexist. Shaken up by the appearance of the second Icon of Fire during the, yeah, so okay. He's the second Icon of Fire. What was his name again? Margrace, yeah, okay. This is so cool. It's like if I forget, like it's right there. Branded, we know about branded, right? Newborn babies are tested at birth. Yep, we know about the branded. Liberation of the bears. Yes, it did this from to save him from slavery. Gather information uh, about masters who most mistreat their property that they might fight focus to rescue efforts on those most in need freed bearers are brought back to the safety of the hideaway and though many are unsure what to do with their newfound freedom the combination of warm milk and warm food and warm bread helps to calm their cares arate stone mysterious ceramic tablet that stands in the hideaway similar construction of other relics of the falling yet seemingly not a part of the airship proper its imposing appearance suggests some important function that has lost been lost to time Whatever strange secret lies within, it seems to react to Clive's presence and urges him to unlock his hidden potential. Airship, legend has it that the people of the fallen ones sail through the skies in the bellies of these ships, though ne all now lie shattered and silent on the surface below, the town of Lost Wing is built around such a ruin. The fallen, the ancient yet highly advanced civilization whose relics said to be the remains of airships that once soared through the skies can be found across the length and breadth of Valisthea. Sid's hideaway is but one of many settlements to take a fallen ruin in its foundation, taking advantage of the sturdiness of ceramics, which are stronger than steel. They are not, however, immune to the passage of time, and so the hideaway is in need of constant repairs. And we did see that. Alliance, those who do 
not call the hideaway their home, but nevertheless lend their strength to Sid's cause. Oh, they're just allies. There are many in the twins who balk at the persecution of bears, but cannot find within them the courage to oppose it. Knowing what fate awaits them, should their sympathies be exposed, others take that risk, aiding Sid's bear liberation efforts with information sent by Stolas, mon monetary assistance, or direct action. Crystal fetters, a restraining device for bears and dominant that use precisely arrange an activated shard of crystal to disrupt the flow of aether through their flesh, thus preventing them from priming or casting magic. So valuable are the materials from which they are made, and so rare the skill required to craft them. They are very few specimens in existence, and they are only employed when absolutely necessary. Marks are emblems of Sid's allies distribute on those in their circle of trust. It is common for the rich and powerful of Valisea to pin such marks on the bearers in their possession that the slaves might go about their master's business unmolested. All right. We met a few new enemies, orcs. Warlike yet surprisingly organized species of beastmen native to Ash, they have long been in conflict with the Valoiders over control of the continent and current count the bulk of its eastern half as their own. However, the encroaching blight continues to eat the amount of livable land, making the fight for more territory, territory more vital. Vampire thorns. While most forests thought of as stationary roots binding them to the soil upon which their matron seed first fell, there are some species which have uncanny capacity for locomotion, such as Northern Storm's vampire thorn. Instead of drawing nutrients from nutriment from the earth, these pitcher-like plants hide themselves in the undergrowth where they wait for prey to happily stumble by, at which time they rush out, emitting a foul cloud of mind-numbing pollen and vicious sap to disorient the victim while they strike and strangulate with a pair of frighteningly long lines. Hornets, most commonly found in the woodlands of Rosaria and western Sambri, hornets are often mistaken for birds due to their prestigious, si prodigious size. This mistake, however, can prove deadly for the overgrown insects are extremely territorial and highly aggressive and will attack aught that might venture near the hive using ginger laden with a poison potent enough to subdue creatures as large as, large as a wyvern. Wy 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 Wolves, individually act lacking in both strength and speed to subdue prey at any considerable size, they'll hunt instead in packs, communicating amongst one another as Ben might, so as to overwhelm their victims. And while forever wary of other creatures, some breeds have been found to be more willing to form bonds with humankind and thus have been found everywhere for tra traveling ma manageries to elite infantry units in the Imperial Army, following rumors of children being mauled by wolves. And the Dushi ordered a mass culling of the beasts, which saw their numbers in Rosario reduced to almost none. Avises, middling dragons whose membrous, brainous wings are attached to their forelegs rather than their torsos, and end in hook like talons used to rip apart the flesh of their prey. Their abundance in Northwestern Storm eventually resulted in mass domestication by the Imperial Legion, which, alongside the spreading of the blight, drove remaining populations south into the deserts of Demelchia, where they now struggle for supremacy with existing species. Fafnir of the North, an ancient dragon adapted exclusively for life on the ground and as such is encased in thick bony armor. Though its kin once claimed dominion over the Northern Territories, the spread of the blight inevitably forced the once gentle giant south in search of prey. Oh, he was your friend. All right, we are oh, caught up in our reading, <laughs> in our lore. We are going to head back to to the Vortex. Um, I should, however, purchase some potion first, and then I will stop. Eat your food while it's hot and see that none goes to waste. Follow Wait. those... Where do I go? This is a shop? No, that's just weapons. Um. Can I get potions from Karen? I don't remember. I feel like I only saw weapons, but let's check. What do you want? Go on then. Yeah, there we go. Oh, I own four. Really? Come again. How come? Don't. I'm not much bothered either way.
Oh yeah. I guess it replenishes when... Hmm. We have anything else? Look what the curl dragged in. Go on then. It'd better I'll be here. I'm just gonna buy one. You'll not find a better price than that. Alright, hold on. Alright, we're gonna we're gonna leave. Uh world map. Let's go back. Alright, so we'll have to go back there intermittently to uh re up on items, get stronger, things like that. Yes. And we will finish this mission next time. Uh, maybe? There he goes! Wait! Clive! What's that? The Dominant. The man who killed my brother. Are you absolutely certain? I've seen him every night for the past 13 years. Watched as the flames of his icon took Joshua. Look out! <gasps> Dead! I'm here, and so's Togo. Don't worry about us. You've been waiting for this. Go! Sit! Oh, we got separated. Forgive me. We're gonna do this next time. Let's save. I feel like things are gonna get wild. It's just us.